Hey everyone, I hope you're all doing wonderfully. Um, so I have a dream that I want to talk about. Um, it was just about maybe a week ago. What happened was I got a severe allergy, um, hay fever, dust allergy. I don't know, I'm getting this really awful hay fever. Uh, dust allergies recently and it's really 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 annoying it makes me so tired like extremely tired the only way I can neutralize this kind of uh, allergy is if I go to sleep so um, it was since I woke up that morning it this allergy just was so persisting it just kept attacking me like crazy <laughs> so i decided you know what i'm gonna go to sleep because i can't deal with this i can't do anything without suffering and without having like a waterfall in my face so i went to sleep and i fell asleep pretty quickly because this kind of allergy makes me so tired for some reason but i went to sleep and i had a dream <laughs> Now what I dreamt was, I dreamt I was, I, it was kind of like I was looking on like a highway and the sun was around 4 or 5 o'clock mark in the afternoon and uh, the, the highway was kind of empty. Now my um, surroundings kind of altered here it was not constant so what I remember was I remember looking to the left like this and I saw what looked like still images still images of millions of people and they were just you know it was just a still image like that's you know that's all I could really tell but it was like a black and white still image okay and I looked across like this and there were more still images of all these people and uh, then I looked back like this again and it's like the background was moving and then suddenly I started seeing something I saw what looked like <laughs> it's very interesting so what I saw these people and I saw their souls from their body just shooting upwards and as I panned my my head across like this I just started seeing more souls shooting upwards and upwards and upwards and upwards and upwards and then I was like oh, it's time I have to get ready and then yeah <laughs> that's all I remember and yeah, I, you know, I have not had a rapture dream in a really, really long time. And, uh, it, it wasn't even on my mind to dream about this. Like, I haven't spoken to it, to, uh, about the rapture to anyone in quite a, a long time. So, this is very, very interesting, you know. Um, this, this dream that I had of... The rapture. Um, so, um, perhaps, perhaps the Lord is awakening <laughs> that sense, that uh, idea, that thing again within me. Because, you know, I used to dream about the rapture dreams so much and then it stopped for a very long time. And now recently it just started again. So, if I do get any more updates, I'll let you know as soon as I can. And, um, yes, just have a blessed day in the Lord. Um, everything is going really well, you know. God is so, has been so good to me every single day. I mean, still today I, I just smile just because I know that He has answered my prayers so beautifully. And whatever you might be facing or going through or desiring just pray to the lord and he'll answer you he's always there with you and uh you know i 
I heard that things are gonna get slightly messy in 2020, but we'll see about that. Especially with this whole election thing. You know, I, I read a passage in the Bible um, not too long ago, actually. Uh, it's... Oh, where did I... I don't remember. I think it was in Proverbs or, or the book of Daniel. I don't remember. It was quite a long time ago. But it specifically spoke about um, Donald Trump. Well, not him, but referring to him. And it's just really sad to see everyone that wants him to get out so desperately. And they have no idea that after him, the Antichrist will come in. I mean, based on what is prophesied that I read in this chapter. Um, I'll see if I can find it again and let you know. But yeah, let's just see what happens. But... May the Lord bless you, and I hope this dream encouraged you. You know the Lord has not forgotten us. The rapture will happen at some point. He's just waiting for the right time. The right time when his people's hearts are ready and the things have fallen into place. In the meantime, just keep carrying on. Do what you're doing and keep him close to you. God bless, and I'll talk to you all again, hopefully soon.